Arrow, Thornton, and Simpson light the fires. The party has started. Here we go into turn number one. RTJ will lead him in that corner for the first time. What a great start for him up the back straightaway, top side of the racetrack. Look at Zietner up the back straight. He'll go to the number four position down in between turns three and four. Chris Madden works the inside of the racetrack, side by side battle up the front straightaway. My goodness, Chad Simpson upstairs. Lap number one belonged to Thornton, but Simpson has the momentum. He's high, he's wide, he's handsome, and he comes out of turn number two with the lead. That top groove just catapulted him. The car stuck. That time he got off the cushion just a little bit, but holds the lead with Thornton second, Madden third, Zeitner fourth, Bloomquist now fifth. Simpson gets way up top. They change lines. Simpson out of the groove. Ricky Thornton Jr. now closes in to within three tenths of a second. Thornton to the inside for the lead in one and two. We are about five laps away from the leaders getting into lap traffic. Chad Simpson holds that number one spot top side of the racetrack right here on the cushion as he comes off the corner. Ricky Thornton Jr. trying to make that thing rotate on the bottom. He had to pinch it off to stay on the bottom side. Simpson showing away with Thornton in hot pursuit. Chris Madden running in third and Justin Zeitner impressing as can be. As right Delaware double foul restart. They work him up the front straight away. Green flag flies from Nate Peterson as they head to turn number one. Look at the battle for the lead down to the inside. Thornton trying to make it happen. Tried to make the slider work and it didn't happen up the back straight away. Great battle back here for the number five spot. Brandon Shepard starting to feel it as well as Sheppy running in the eighth position but he's about to take on both Bluquist and Winger, and Scott Bluquist just shoved that car between Winger and Shepard. There was no room. You couldn't fit a spoonful of truffle butter in there. No, there was absolutely. Oh, and he got it shot in the shorts up the back straightaway. Brandon Shepard just hit the rear end of Scott Bloomquist going into turn number three. He was not too happy with that move. So well, here we go. Thornton after Simpson. This time Simpson is plugged on the outside and blocked. We have a new leader maybe at the line. No, still Simpson. Simpson will work to the inside as they work up the back straightaway here. He'll go underneath the wall and up the back stretch. Can't make it happen. Thornton down to the inside is going to try and take advantage of lap traffic. Once they get past these two cars, it's a straightaway to the next group of lap cars. Absolutely. So whoever comes out of this with the lead once they get past both the 98 of round and the 66 C of Cosner could seal the deal because there's a lot of racing room but right now that is not happening guess what knock knock who's there Ricky Weiss he's coming He's working the inside. He rides third down off of turn number four. The lap cars are side by side. Round oh, in the, the wall. Round in the wall. The front end folded up on Ron. Two thirds of the race in the book under the Nate Peterson green flag. A great start for Chad Simpson. He'll go directly upstairs. Thornton knew what he wanted. He tried the slider, didn't work. He's got Weiss behind him and he's hungry. Here comes Winger as well. What a battle for second. Oh boy, Ashton Winger has found something. Oh, and that time the cushion giveth, the cushion taketh away. He had to get off of it and let three cars go by. So Winger, who has had aspirations of going in the top five as Cody Evans slows down. We may see caution here. Cody Evans coasting in turn number one. I don't think he's going to make it back in time. We're going to keep our eyes on the 4G as they work out of turn number four and caution will wave. Two thirds the way through this contest. Down off of turn number four, Chad Simpson on the loud pedal. He'll head to turn number one. So again, Weiss and Thornton will go after it for the number two spot. There's Madden in the fourth position. And he'll set his sights on the seven with the one of Shepard to his outside. Battle for the number two spot. Ricky Weiss to the inside of Ricky Thornton Jr. at the line. Still Thornton. Weiss to the bottom side of the racetrack, trying to find moisture with the left rear tire. They'll head up the back straightaway side by side. Can he close the door? No, almost contact down in between three and four now. So leader Chad Simpson, high, wide, and handsome out of turn number four. Thornton will follow Super. Here comes Ricky Weiss down low. Now Weiss is going to make a bid for the number two spot and a shot at Simpson. Gets good traction, but not enough as high side momentum will keep Thornton in second. Thornton Weiss is there as well. He's working the middle to the bottom, and the two leaders up front rim riding up the back straightaway. Down the back stretch and heading into turn number three. This time they will see eight fingers and two thumbs. It is 10 laps to go. For Chad Simpson, Ricky Thornton, Ricky Weiss, Brandon Shepard, and Chris Madden here at Jackson. So 10 to go, and don't look now, but we will get into lap traffic in about five laps. Simpson got a little loose off of two. That might be the door opening that Thornton needed. He'll go to the inside. Can he make it happen off the corner? Ricky Thornton Jr. is not going to give up. He is not going to go away quietly as the 25 of Simpson got a little out of the cushion, and that allowed Thornton to close the gap. Just as we get to checkered, we should be right at the cusp of the rear markers, and that's going to be Thornton's chance because Thornton right now can't do it as far as open racetrack goes. 
with a racetrack full of competitors. Oh, that time over the cushion went Simpson. One mistake is all it took. Ricky Thornton Jr. is now in the lead. When will it happen? We'll find out. Green in the air. Here we go. He'd like to add his name to the winner's list. He goes to the top side of the racetrack, and he just wants to run away and hide. White's trying to come up and slide in front of Chad Simpson. That's not going to happen. Ricky Thornton Jr. has got to run five. Perfect laps down off of turn number four. Five fingers in the air from Nate Peterson as they head to turn one. It's the Ricky and Ricky show because Weiss has taken second away from Chad Simpson. Cut him off there. Here comes Shepard. Ricky Thornton Jr. showing away. Simpson to the inside of Weiss. Here comes Brandon Shepard now. He's specking the horse for all it's worth. We have four laps to go. Thornton's still leading. Weiss kind of jumped the cushion there just a little bit. He'll cut off and shut the door in a 25 of Chad Simpson. My goodness, Simpson will lose another spot up the back straight away to Brandon Shepard. And this is exactly what Ricky Thornton Jr. needed. We're within five laps to go, and he could be headed to a $20,000 payday. Brandon Shepard goes to third and puts Simpson in his back pocket. Chase Young ends is now closing in on Madden for the number five spot. Ricky Thornton Jr. will get the two to go signal this time. Weiss, a good seven car lengths behind. Shepard, 10 behind. Two laps to go. White flag the next time by. Brandon Shepard in a podium position right now. He wants the two spot as he works the outside up the back straightaway. Will he have a run off the hero maker cushion up the back stretch? Yes, he will. He'll work the outside of the racetrack. Rick Eshelman, we're coming to one to go. Well, this is it. The final time around here at Jackson Motorplex for the Dryden Double Down Invitational. That time, Weiss gained a little ground. Here comes Shepard all over Weiss for second. In the turn number three, out of turn number four, checker flag is waving. RTJ is the MAN. He has won here at Jackson. Ricky Thornton Jr. picks up his first ever win. Second will go to Ricky Weiss. Third to Brandon Shepard. Fourth to Chad Simpson. Chris Madden will come home in fifth. It's Hopefully all of those fans at home watching on Dirt Vision are clapping for a first time winner. Making the roof climb. He's celebrating like there's 6,000 strong here. For live coverage of every World of Outlaws series event and for extended on-demand race content, visit DirtVision.com. For full race results, highlights, and series news, visit WorldOfOutlaws.com.